quit and never give up. When you first join the military and you actually arrive to boot camp, they place you in receiving and you go through indoctrination where you go through medical testing, you know, re-swearing in and things like that. In that process, there's a lot of stress that's put on us as recruits to move from point A to point B in the most direct manner and moving in the process of moving back and forth to medical. My brother slipped a disc in his back and he went to medical and they said that, you know, you can no longer train. And the drone instructor called me up and said, you know, get up here, Nichols. So I come running up and he's like, your freaking brother's going away. And let me guess, you want to go away with him too. And, you know, at the time, I didn't know what he was talking about. I knew my brother had gotten hurt, but I wasn't sure exactly what was happening to him. He's got, you got a freaking minute to go determine if you're going to stay in boot camp or you're going to go home with him. I ran over to the corner. My brother said, look, I, I want you to stay here. I want you to do this for us. See it through. I'm hurt. You know, they're going to send me to MRP, which is Medical Rehabilitation Platoon, and I want you to stay. And I was like, you know, I'm going to stay and I'm going to see this through. And from that point forward, I made a decision to move forward with my life. And I didn't even realize that in this whole process, him making the decision to join the Marine Corps, me signing up several weeks before he left to join the Marine Corps was kind of my jumpstart to get involved with the military 